The copper disk of radius r is rotating with an angular speed omega. A uniform magnetic field of magnitude b is acting perpendicular to the disk. We know from Faraday's law that the magnitude of the EMF produced is equal to the rate of change of flux linkage. Although the total flux linkage of the disk doesn't change as it rotates, we can imagine it consisting of lots of individual wires from the center to the edge, which are rotating about. And these are cutting through magnetic field lines, which means there must be an EMF induced across them. To calculate the EMF, think about the rate of flux swept out by a wire going from the center to the edge of this disk over the entire rotation.